My name is Ziming. I'm program officer for Sina project in Malaysia. Um, we are doing a lot of open government and open data works. Um, we also focus on digital rights issues, especially the security related stuff. We are doing training for the activist group, journalists, lawyers and at risk community. In Malaysia and we also have regional partners that we are doing together in Southeast Asia. Most of them come to us like asking about how can we <coughs> like send a more secure email to partners and <coughs> a third party cannot read about that. Yeah, so we just provide them some alternative about this and then we do a step by step installation with them together. Yeah, and explain how it works. Most of them are they more worried about the government. Yeah. The, like uh from the authorities also, police and then state sponsored trolls, like cyber troopers and it are uh, mostly involved with those uh death threats. Most of the organizations we met Mm, they actually feel secure when using GPG for their communication on email. Last year, we met two journalists from Al Zazira. They they actually doing investigative journalism on <coughs> baby trafficking. So they they deal with a lot of information with some parties, lawyers. So. They, they came to us and they asked us how, how to make the email secure. So we teach them how to use GPG. And then they actually went back and told their partners to use the same things. It is very important for them to use GPG on, on their investigation cases. Um, also, after the videos published, their video published, and then the authority came to them and their devices confiscated. <clears throat> Before that, they actually deleted, uh, because they're using Thunderbird for the GBG, so they deleted the, um, the program on their laptops. So when the police uh, investigate their devices, they can't, they can't read the email. So yeah, this is what the feedback I got from them. So they feel using the GBG is very, very safe for them.